The 2023 Balloon Dior ceremony is expected to take place on the 30th of October in Paris. The favourites to win the prestigious individual accolade are none other than Argentine veteran Lionel Messi and Manchester City's Erling Haaland. For Lionel Messi, the Argentine international will be hoping to lay his hands on what will be a record eight-time Balloon d'Or award, while his closest challenger, Erling Haaland, will be having his first shot at the prestigious individual award after a remarkable 2022-23 football campaign with Manchester City. Meanwhile, the big question on everyone's lips is, who really deserves the 2023 Balloon d'Or award between Lionel Messi and Erling Haaland? This video will take a look at a couple of key stats for both players as we compare their chances of winning the award later this month. Let's go! Goal Contributions As we all know, goals most times play a key role in determining who wins the Balloon d'Or award and both Haaland and Messi boast of remarkable goal contributions heading into the award finale. Erling Haaland, Manchester City the 22-year-old Norwegian striker had a remarkable 2022-23 football campaign for both club and country. Harlan played a key role in helping Pep Guardiola's city side clinch a historic quadruple, which included the club's first ever UEFA Champions League title. He bagged a combined total of 53 goals in 52 appearances for Manchester City, the most scored by any player across Europe's top leagues during the 2022-23 football campaign. Erling Haaland netted 36 goals in 35 league appearances to clinch the prestigious Premier League Golden Boot in its first ever season in England. After securing a £51 million move from Borussia Dortmund in the summer of 2022, his remarkable goal-scoring form was enough to silence his critics, who had initially doubted the Norwegian's chances of making it in the Premier League. Haaland also bagged double-digit goals in the 2022-23 UEFA Champions League campaign, scoring 12 goals en route to Manchester City, lifting the title. And just like he did in the Premier League, Haaland's 12 UEFA Champions League goals were enough to see him clinch the UEFA for Champions League Top Scorers Award for the 2022-23 football campaign. His 12 goals scored during the competition meant that he averaged more than one goal per game during the tournament. Lionel Messi Just like Erling Haaland, Argentine veteran Lionel Messi also had a remarkable spell in front of goal during the 2022-23 football campaign for both club and country. Despite being 35 years of age, Messi was still able to register a total of 40 goals and 26 assists within the calendar period, which will be taken into consideration by the Balloon d'Or Award organisers, which is between August the 1st to July the 31st. Lionel Messi netted 16 league goals for former club Paris Saint-Germain. While it may look quite lower than what Haaland got in the Premier League last season, Messi somehow made up for his goal contributions by registering an impressive tally of 16 league assists for Les Parisiens. As a matter of fact, Lionel Messi was the only player in Europe's top flight leagues to register 15 plus goals and assists during the 2022-23 football campaign, a record he has previously achieved on five different occasions. Aside from his goal-scoring exploits with former club Paris Saint-Germain, Lionel Messi was terrific in front of goal at the 2022 FIFA World Cup, which was held in Qatar last year. The Argentine captain bagged an impressive total of seven goals and three assists, en route to Argentina, lifting the trophy. He also narrowly missed out on the Golden Boot Award to former teammate Kalium Mbappé, who scored eight goals as against the seven scored by Lionel Messi. Individual awards and trophies. Trophies won during the time frame under review also plays a key role in boosting a player's chances of winning the Balloon d'Or award. And as expected, Haaland and Messi had a remarkable trophy run last season. Erling Haaland, Manchester City and Norway. 
The Norwegian striker did break a couple of records during the 2022-23 football campaign and as expected, scooped home a handful of individual awards to add to his impressive trophy cabinet. Erling Haaland was voted as the Football Writers Association Footballer of the Year for the 2022-23 football campaign. He also won the Premier Player of the Season award, Premier League Young Player of the Season and Premier League Golden Boot Trophy. The 22-year-old striker was added to the ESM Team of the Year and UEFA Champions League Team of the Season. He clinched the UEFA Champions League Top Scorers Award, UEFA Men's Player of the Year Award and, not forgetting, the UEFA Nations League Top Scorers Award, where he bagged six goals for Norway. Haaland was also voted Manchester City's Player of the Season and PFA Players Player of the Year award respectively. Adding to his never-ending individual honours for last season, the Norwegian striker won a historic quadruple with Manchester City. He helped the citizens lift the Premier League, FA Cup, UEFA Champions League and UEFA Super Cup titles respectively. Lionel Messi the Argentine veteran is arguably the most decorated player in the world of football and, as expected, he won a couple of trophies and individual awards during the time frame under review. Lionel Messi was voted Argentina's Player of the Year for 2022. He also won the Laureus World Sportsman of the Year award and he also won the Best FIFA Men's Player of the Year award and was voted the best player at the 2022 FIFA World Cup in Qatar, scooping home the Golden Ball Award. Messi also received the FIFA World Cup silver boot after netting seven goals in the competition, which included a spectacular World Cup final brace against runners-up France. As regards trophies, won during the 2022-2023 football calendar, Lionel Messi won a league double with former club Paris Saint-Germain, which included the League One title and the Trophée de Champagne. Lionel Messi also won the Comebol UEFA Cup of Champions, which took place last year as Argentina defeated then European champions Italy by 3-0. However, the most important part of them all will definitely be the 2022 FIFA World Cup title, which Messi won with Argentina in December last year. Many football lovers are even of the opinion that the World Cup trophy may play a key role in boosting Lionel Messi's chances of clinching a record 8 Ballon d'Or award later this month. Looking at both players' stats side by side, who do you think stands a better chance of winning the 2023 Balloon d'Or award between Erling Haaland and Lionel Messi come the 30th of October? So please drop your opinions in the comment section below this video. If you enjoyed watching this video, please give it a thumbs up, subscribe to the channel and turn on the bell notifications so you don't miss our future videos.